Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's work on the problem 14 in chapter 5. In this one, things become very similar to our previous questions. You can see we know the initial, we know the displacement, right, for this car, 72 meter. And we also know the final velocity uh, because this car stops. And we need to know the initial uh, velocity to make sure this car is over speed or not. So it looks like we want to know the initial velocity. So we need to know acceleration to solve the initial velocity. Do you agree? Now, how can we find the acceleration? There, it tells you the coefficient for kinetic friction, 0 0.8. So we do the force analysis. On this car, you can see we have the gravity. We have normal force and we also have friction. So we can write the Newton's second law. First of all, in the y component, we have normal force minus the gravity equals zero. In the horizontal component, we have negative friction equals mass times acceleration. And this friction equals the coefficient times the normal force, right? Now we can solve these three equations. Get the acceleration is negative mu coefficient times the g. Now you can see we know the acceleration and look at these uh, equations. It's easy for us to get the initial velocity. This is our strategy. Now we just input the known quantities, we know the acceleration, and then we input all the quantities. This acceleration is just a negative mu kg, and then we get the final answer, 34 meters per second. Thank you.